This tutorial is about placing orders. After you clock in as a waiter, you are now ready to enter your orders into the POS system. From the main menu screen, you first press on the Dine In button. This is usually at the top left corner of the screen. As usual, the pop-up security prompt comes up and you must enter your access code to proceed. Here, I will enter my access code, which is 123, and press the enter button. On the next screen is the select table number window, and this is where you must choose a table. Depending on where the customer is seated, you can select the appropriate table number. In this case, I will select table 7. Once I do that, the system immediately prompts me to enter the number of guests on this table. I will answer appropriately. In this case, I will select 2 because there are only 2 people seated at this table. It then brings me to the main ordering page. Here you will see the left sides all the various menu groups. For example, appetizers, drinks, entrees, pasta, and etc. Once you select the menu group, for example, if we select appetizers, all items within this group will be listed on the middle of the window. You can then proceed to select the items you wish to order. In this case, I will select the menu group appetizers, then pick the items onion rings, nachos, and potato skins. Notice as I pick the items, it immediately shows the item that I pick on the right side receipt window. You can confirm your order by looking at this receipt window. To order more items, simply repeat the process and choose accordingly. Once you are finished, all you have to do is press the done button at the bottom right corner. Once you press this button, the POS system will automatically send out the order to the appropriate kitchen printers and will prompt you to print the guest ticket. If you plan to add more items to this order later, then you do not need to print the guest ticket at this time. You should only print the guest ticket when you are ready to present the guest ticket to the customer.